It's been a renaissance this year in Charlottesville. Opening faceoff, Austin Henningsen and Petey LaSalle up for Virginia. And Ryan Conrad, that switchblade, comes up with the ground ball. Virginia to Mayo. Up top to Fairman. Now Bernhardt from the wing. A bad shot and a score. The Tawarta. The executed outlet pass. Mishandled by Virginia. And the penalty means you got to play more man down defense. Bernhardt just given too much real estate from the right wing. Sets his feet and uses the earth. Look at that big bounce shot kick into the upper portions. Turnovers for Virginia. Terps are crisp. They are. Good chance here. Shot the score to Mayo from Wisnowskis. Two nothing. Tasted championship weekend since 2011. And Anthony DeMeo's got the Turks up to zip. Experience. Moore backing down Corley. Moore finds an angle and rips one top shelf. The kid has blossomed. It's unguardable. Corley's in great position. Brings the stick back on stick, falling down to the turf, almost blind to the goal. Kark Moore pings stop his momentum first. When he turns and you see the back of his jersey, that's the time to double. Fairman, Wisnowskis, one more. And Maryland with a 3 1 lead. Of us in the car were thinking, how could they possibly match up against this Virginia offense? Time slides for starters, man. That's a, a pinch double team to perfection at the other end. You get that Virginia defense on the carousel. The ball absolutely back. devoured, and the Cavaliers get it back. Final minute of quarter number one. Laviano on the doorstep. Defense and tenacity leading to... And maybe he doesn't have the flair of an Aiken or a Krause or a Moore. See, Virginia, Virginia's always, offsides right there, Kark. You see yeah. the top of the screen. Virginia was offsides on that. Well, they got away with it. And then off ball. Has it stick checked away. Good trail check. And now the outlet to Connors, who's a threat to score. A long pole has 12 goals. Make it 13 for his career. Keep your eyes on his trail check right there. Alex Road has improved drastically in terms of his outlets. Virginia sets up a kind of an inverted V break. It puts a lot of... Virginia, so Maryland ball. Well, twice already, Kark, we've seen Virginia use its defense to get offense. That's what they want. Bernhardt to the cage, diving and scoring. Will it count? It does. So fast. Watch this, he uses the pick. It's a full head of s speed. He almost steps on that line again. Very similar to a goal he scored last week in the first round. Does he step on the white line? Can't see it, but he's got blinding speed. The former high school quarterback executing the triple option. Harris. Now met by John. Corey, step right. Yeah, they're going after Harris. And DeMeo <laughs> shoots and scores. A flag is down was to put pressure on number eight, Corey Harris, to isolate him and to capitalize. They wanted no part of 14, Matt Jama. Here you see the wing move. An inside pipe shot by DeMeo. DeMeo scored. That's a costly turnover. Virginia still down a man with 25 seconds left on the Maryland man up. Doesn't matter! Man down goal, Ryan Comrade. And tied him up. Got him to the ground, Virginia's ball, the quick restart, and then the switch blade. This kid is unbelievable. I said it in the... After the face-off win. Nearly another penalty there on Jama. There the knockback, Bernhardt again ripping corners. That's the... He throws it to him where he's going to be open. Not where he's standing, but watch him throw this open in front of him so he can catch it in stride. Little lob pass, change of levels, a low release to a high placement. Jama across the midfield line. 
Final 10 seconds. Here's Conrad. Top of the box. Beating inside. Laviano catches in. Virginia team scores, Ian Laviano, the sophomore from Long Island. But look who's doing the dealing. Conrad, we saw him on ground balls. We saw him scoring goals off of isolation. And now he's dealing, and the Cavs are feeling it. Conrad's he can do a little too much at times. Feeding inside, Kraus, nothing there. On the doorstep, Herring, and we are even at six. When Mikey Herring shoots, he Double usually... team. Watch it, right side of your screen, right there. Draws the eyes of the defense. Kraus draws two, spins it. 23 in red, Kyle Long. His emotion shows what happened here. That's his man sneaking from X. Yeah, 73 percent. It's unbelievable, Quint. You think statistically of Herring, but Kyle Long's a high school. Now has the shorty Jama. Good look that time. It's not there on the doorstep. Wisnowski stokes it in. Catches it. I think the entire Virginia defense thinks this ball's going out of bounds and they'll be able to reset. Not so fast. Bernhardt heads up. Wisnowskis cashes in. Wisnowskis and Bernhardt, the first man dumps it back behind. In front looking for more. He can't handle the pass. Scooped up by Connor. Going up top. Aiken stepped down and we are tied. This is the scoop off the ground ball right here and Aiken top of the arc turning rake too much power let's see if they go quickly off the restart they do Puglisi Bernhardt Bernhardt Whoa -ho! that had some heat field level and one is when you rip one off the pipe and it goes in over and back. Cavaliers, little mishap, quick restart for the Terps. Slinging it one and red. Situation awareness defensively off that turnover. Get in the hole. Understand strengths. Talk about helping to patrol the crease. DeMeo. Dodging on Jama. DeMeo with the hat trick. Took some work to beat Matt Jama that time. Back by DeMeo. This is a big time move by DeMeo. Understanding where he is on goal line extended in the second. Dubik did not have an angle. Wasn't positioned right. Shot clock at three. Wisnowski to Dubik. Backbreaker like this but the experience the championship pedigree and the playmakers like Logan Wisnaskis this kid is known as a lefty scorer but his vision is grossly underestimated great high school basketball player sees the field Dubek Johnny on this Massey pushed the goal line extended skip pass Zawadzki scores the fifth year senior from Long Island and Merrill has been punchless. Just eating minutes. How about this pass? Across the defense, the reaction is slow. Plant your feet and let it go left handed. That is a huge emotional swing. Carrier on an island. So when the ball's on the far side, if I'm a middle, middle of the field type player, I gotta get within 15 yards of my teammate. Lead of the shot clock and it's the Mayo. Four goals for the sophomore out of San Diego. Catches and releases and shoots fire in the same motion. That's what DeMeo does. He catches the ball high, puts his stick low, all in one motion, and look where Road is. No shot. Man up goals. Moore's got five with the extra man. Here's Moore. Feeding inside. Conrad fakes high, shoots low. And a sliver of hope still there. Again, showing his versatility. He's a two-way midi. He plays the low righty spot on man up. Nice, nice catch and finish. Look away pass from Moore is on the money.
tiptoe on the crease line. That pass is reset. Not that that matters for Virginia right now with three and a half to play. Zone defense again. Which makes an offense work. Conrad does the work. It's 12-9, three and a half to go. Fielder in college lacrosse. His career's over. Down by three, three and change with this offense. And Conrad on your side. You still got a ball game. It's not putting up their usual numbers. This might be on Conrad. Yeah, but he's basically having a Herculean effort here. 22 and white. Laviano makes it a two goal game. Hang on. This is a disaster for Maryland's defense. Conrad draws three. You see the late hit on Puglisi draws the foul. There's some confusion. Are we in man? Are we in zone? Mark up. Laviano left all alone in the low slot. I like the change of pace by Laviano. Inside, looking for Conrad. The dunk not there. Herring closest to the ball where it went out. 40 seconds on the man up. Conrad coming around the bend. Conrad to the rescue again. Back to where he thinks they belong. The initial miss. And now keep your eyes on 22. He'll just curl top side and pre present that visual target. And so cool and calm. Buries that one. 5-0 on Dolan. He has become a scorer late in the season. Five goals in round one. He was... Hey, hey! Aiken against the short stick. Kraus oh! oh! And hits the crossbar! Virginia still has it. New 82nd clock. Wow, they're calling it a goal. They're Are you kidding me? Goal. Are you kidding me? Wow. You make the call at home. I think it'll be pretty simple. That's pipe. That's 100% pipe. Wow. Ball must entirely cross the goal line. There's no replay in NCAA lacrosse. And th this is one of the most unfortunate calls that I've seen in watching this tournament for the last 40 years. 30 seconds. Here comes Kraus. Slithers in. His shot wide. Kraus from X. Flips it back to Moore on the doorstep. Laviano not enough on it. It dies near the end line. Five seconds. More. Three seconds. Feeding inside. And we have overtime. Here comes Kraus. Against Corley. Kraus. Over to Moore. For the win. Virginia going to championship weekend. Kraus draws the double team. The defense just sloughs in, giving Moore all sorts of space on the weak side of the formation. Catch, little crow step, and velocity from about 10 yards. This was a goal. There was no doubt, and the Cardiac Cavaliers with a little luck and a fortunate call that